Construction is kicking off for a new laboratory and research facility in the heart of Dallas. Yeah, their researchers are going to be focusing on communicable diseases. That's going to be diseases that spread from person to person, even hu uh, person to animal. Uh, it's going to be illnesses like HIV, TB, and more. Yeah, Kennedy Walker is joining us live now from Dallas with more on all of this. Kennedy? Hey, good morning, Stephen Madison. Yes, a very exciting day here in Dallas. That groundbreaking actually is supposed to start any minute now, but if you look behind me, I know it just looks like a big pile of dirt and gravel, and it is, but soon it will be a new state-of-the-art laboratory and research facility, and it will be the first of its kind here in Dallas. Leaders from the city of Dallas and the Health and Human Services Department, they are here to celebrate this $52 million project. It will be three stories tall and approximately approximately 70,000 square feet. The facility will focus on communicable diseases, testing like HIV, hepatitis C, TB, and the West Nile virus. And it will also have the capacity to test for things like Zika, Ebola, COVID, and the flu, among others. Officials tell me that this project was needed so that the Dallas County Health and Human Services can stay on the cutting edge of research and laboratory service delivery. Now, this is expected to be completed by 2025, so a very fast project and one that officials say is very needed in this community. Reporting live in Dallas, Kennedy Walker, CBS 